Well, a group of Ada firefighters are on their way to a small Texas town for a special delivery. They're headed to Abbott, a town that was devastated after a fertilizer plant exploded back in April. It's a story that we brought you all morning long as that group of firefighters prepared to leave for the long-awaited trip. 24-hour news aides Coco McAvoy was at the Ada Fire Department this morning and spoke to that group of firefighters before they left for Texas. Brothers helping brothers. More than just a slogan, it's the message that motivated the Ada Fire Department to donate a fire truck to a small Texas community. The whole fire service is uh, all about everybody helps everybody. And to be able to help us come somebody this far away is a little unusual, but it really is just great to be able to uh, help somebody who doesn't have anything. Engine number E227, with a tank full of gas, a few snacks, and only the company of each other, four firefighters crammed into the truck to personally deliver it to the Lone Star State. It's huge. Um, not just our department, it's the whole community's getting involved. David Murray is one of the four firefighters. He says this all started off as a small fundraiser to cover the cost of gas, but turned into a worldwide campaign. We're getting donations um, from all over Michigan. We sold t-shirts in 14 different states overseas to the guys in the service. They say without the help from the community, much of the fundraising would not have been possible. The community has just been outstanding. We, we're going to be able to give them, I believe it's over $12,000 besides the truck. And that's all money that just the community's raised. Engraved on the back of the fire truck lists the names of the 11 firefighters lost in the explosion. A gentle reminder of the devastating event that happened that day in Texas, but also a dedication to those firefighters who will forever be a part of the brotherhood. In Ada, I'm Coco McAvoy, 24 Hour News 8. Now, the firefighters will be documenting their entire trip to Texas through their Facebook page. We have a link set up at widtv.com.